Hello YouTube, today I'm going to show you how to create a copy of your Kerbal Space Program game so that you can maybe have another uh, game with saves that are different or mods that are different um, and make it work properly with Steam so that uh, you can launch it through Steam and still get the Steam in-game overlay and everything. So the first thing we're going to do is um, open up this folder here which I've already opened which is my Steam Steam apps, then common folder, and this is going to have all the games that you've got installed probably. Uh, this is my solid state drive, so I only have a few installed on here. But uh, the first thing we're going to do is uh, click on Kerbal Space Program, hit Control C, then hit Control V, or you can just right click and do copy, and then right click again and do paste. And uh, you should take a while to copy these over, depends how fast your hard drive is, and you'll end up with a folder like this. So from here we're going to rename this, I'm going to call it Kerbal Space Program with Mods, um, and then we need to go into Steam, hit Add a Game, Add a non-Steam Game, hit Browse, and we're going to go into that same folder, uh, the Kerbal Space Program with Mods folder here. Then we're going to hit uh, ksp.exe and hit Open, and uh, you should see KSP at the top, and it should be uh, ticked at the left hand side there. Now if we hit add selected programs and uh, look in our Steam library, so it's down here for me, it is a KSP there, and uh, there it is. So now we can go into the properties and rename it. I'm going to call it Kerbal Space, uh, gotta love Mac keyboards, Kerbal Space Program with mods, again, gotta love Mac keyboards there, and uh, from there, we can, uh, I'm going to add it to my favorites, but everything should work absolutely fine. You can install your mods into that uh, Kerbal Space Program with Mods folder, or do whatever you want. It's basically a separate copy of the game, and uh, you can launch it just by hitting play, just like that. Anyway guys, I hope the video helped. If it did, then it'd be awesome if you could give it a thumbs up or a favorite. And as always, thanks for watching, and have a nice day.